Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all doing really, really well. Uh, if you're brand new to my channel, welcome uh, to the fam. If you haven't hit the subscribe button yet, please make sure to do so because it really, really helps me out. I film all different types of content, lifestyle, hauls, challenges and everything else in between. So if you think you like that type of content, I'd really appreciate it if you did subscribe and join the fam. Just want to say a big hello to all my new subscribers as well. Thank you for the love and the support. And if you haven't hit the bell notification in the corner yet, please make sure to do so because it means that every time I upload a video, you guys will be notified about it and you will not miss any of my content. Also as well, I will leave in the comments bar below my Instagram and my TikTok and also my Vinted. I have got a huge pile of clothes in the corner of this room here in a massive bag. I've got two massive bagfuls of clothes and I have listed everything on my vintage and a lot of it has actually gone but there's also a lot left as well because of that wardrobe. If you watched my last video it was absolutely full of clothes and I've literally got rid of 80% and yeah it all just needs to go. I can't even cope looking at it anymore in my room. There's just too much shit going on in this corner. I'm actually filming a Timu haul today. This is um, sponsored by Timu, now they did give me um, a code to spend, but I actually did it wrong. So I still got a really good deal, but I actually did pay for everything when I was supposed to not, if you see what I mean. It was supposed to be sponsored by Timu, but I I don't know. The email that I got sent, like the business email, I'm obviously misread and didn't use the code properly. So I actually bought all of this stuff. <laughs> um, which, uh, like I said, it's still really cheap, but it was actually meant to not cost me anything, and it actually cost me £118. Um, all of it together should have been £260, but I paid £118. It came in two different packages. If you don't know what Timo is as well, it's basically like an upgraded new version of Wish, but the stuff is like way better quality. I've got to say, I have opened both packages and had like a quick look just to make sure that everything were there, and I actually am really, really impressed with everything uh, that I've got, particularly the electronics that I've got um the tech stuff is really really good and like I say I am not going to do this in any particular order the first thing that I've got are these vacuum flask sets now me and my brother are going to start going camping we're going to do car camping in the car and then eventually we're going to get tents and stuff like that but uh, we've just sort of started like buying bits of camping stuff gradually because it's not cheap um, but Timo actually had some really, really, really good camping stuff. They've got all sorts of skincare, clothes, camping stuff for the car, pets, makeup, skincare, you name it. They've got everything. So I ordered these and they come in this little bag as well, if I can. And it's these here and it's like a camping set. So you've got a flask and then you've got three cups. To be fair, I did think the cups were going to be bigger. They're quite small. I'm not going to lie. That's how big they are. I did think that they were going to be a little bit bigger. But these were, I believe, $6.99, which is really, really good for camping gear. And then obviously you also get the flask as well with another cup on side. And it says vacuum bottle, 500ml, 12 hours hot and 12 hours cold. Next thing that I've got, I can't remember what is in any of this stuff, so it's going to be as much a surprise to me as it is to you. And again, it's more camping stuff. So I was looking at camping pans and um, they're all a bit pricey individually, but um, on Timu they've actually got, I did think they'd be bigger, I won't lie, these were 12 99 so they've actually got the little like frying pan look and then this hand like sort of comes out like this so that's like a little frying pan there um i think it comes with one i think it comes with four oh it comes with one two three four so you get four pans all for 12 99 which I think is really, really good. And it's really handy because they all like stack together because the handles come round like this and then you just stack everything sort of like this look, like that. So it's just really, really safe um, space saving. And then they all just stack together like that. I got 29 items. I got a couple of uh, duplicates of just a couple of things, but everything is pretty much individual again on with the camping stuff these i watch a lot of camping vloggers my brother does as well and we watch one guy called liam brown and when he cooks on like his little like um, stove it looks like a little bunsen burner but it's for cooking food on when you're camping and uh, he has these things here and it's basically like oh it's basically the things come out 
but it's basically like a big um, metal, I don't know what the material is, but is it aluminium? A big, oh no, it's all coming out everywhere. Look, you can see that I've not been camping in a while. I'm all over the shop. Why won't that go in? So this is obviously much longer usually, and then you have like the way you're cooking, and then this, Oh, great, fantastic. What is going on? Oh, look, I promise you, I'm not breaking everything, guys. It's just, this has just come out, look. And it just needs to go in like this. So, when it's windy, the wind doesn't blow out the flame on the little gas cooker. I think these were about £2 each. I've got two packs of them, and it's good they also come in like a little draw bag as well the next two thing two things the next thing that i've got are some glass straws i won't get them out you all know what glass straws but like you get four you get two that sort of go like that and then you get like two straight ones um and i think yeah you also do get a little cleaner in there as well they went 99p for glass straws which i thought was really really good I'll show you this as well. So basically, this is my phone, and this is a phone case that I got. It's kind of like a mat, but not rubber, if you see what I mean. And what I like about the phone case is, that the, number one, they were only 89p. I got this colour, and then I also got a colour in, I don't know if that's picking up, it's like a nude brown, because I had a rubber cover on it, and when putting it in my pocket, it would just like stick in, and it was a bit of a nightmare. So yeah, so I've got this colour, and this colour that I've currently got on, so this is like a, like a light brown, and this is like a nice nude colour, and obviously, it's getting to autumn, winter now, I mean, quite frankly, we're in August, but in the UK, it's basically autumn. I'm not being funny with you, it's like blowing a gale, rain, wind, we've had thunderstorms, so yeah, um, it's basically autumn. So I just thought that these colours would be really, really nice, and these were 89p, and it also feels really really good on my phone as well it makes the phone very square because obviously i have an iphone and obviously it's glass but all the edges are rounded so i find that the phone can just fucking fly out your fucking hand and they're not cheap to replace and again another one of the um protectors for the camping fire so the wind doesn't blow it out now these as well now this is something that i never thought i'd say but i'm really getting into glassware i think it's because i'm getting more and more excited to get my own place eventually so i've started sort of like collecting a few little bits so it's not such a big cost when i do move out and can we just look at this glass look at that this was a one pound 99 so this is the middle size one i've got another one in this shape that's bigger i'll show you it so that is what it looks like i think that for a glass is absolutely beautiful imagine that glass with the glass straw do you know what I mean? Because that, in any other store, would cost you an absolute fortune. So I got one in that size, like I say. That was about £2.99. And then I've got the bigger one, which is here. And I think this one was £3.99. Um, I saw somebody ordered this in a Timu uh, video that I watched. And they were like, you could use it as a little vase, which I suppose you could. But look at the size of that compared to my head. So that is obviously the bigger version of it. I just love how it's sort of like all ribbed on the inside and then goes like that. I just think it's really funky. I mean, that for a glass, that is cool as shit. I'm sorry. I just got to think about nice glasses. Do you know what I mean? And I think that's pretty beautiful. So yeah, that was, I think, 3 99 for that. So with this, it's actually a set. Now... To be fair, I don't know if this is the one that I actually ordered because I do not remember a... Oh, no, sorry. No, this is a different glass. This is a different glass. So, I... <laughs> yeah. I bought four glasses, so it comes really well packaged. Now, this, I really, really like. Look at this. Look at that. That's glass. This was 2 .99. Look at that. Glass lid. Glass cup. Eh? Iced coffee and that. So, it comes with the lid... And obviously the cup, but then it also comes with a glass straw. Eh? Being funny with you. Do you know what I mean? Um, and again, really, really cheap for the price. The only issue that I'm finding with this is, you know, the rubber thing here, it's a little bit wonky. So I feel like it's, you know, when I'm trying to actually put it on, it's kind of sort of jamming a little bit. See what I mean? Look. See that there? It's sort of a little bit, you can see it's a little bit wonky. I need to sort that out. I'll be able to sort it out. But uh, yeah, for the price, I mean... Oh, look, I've done it. I was being an idiot. Look, there we are. So that's what it looks like there. Glass lid. Nice sort of like beveled there. I just think it's really nice. And like for the price, like I say, like really, really cheap. I use something else as well. I've had a fucking nightmare with a jacket, right? And if you watch my TikTok, because if you don't, 
go and follow my TikTok because I just felt like a twat on there, but it's like a really good time, a really good laugh. I basically, I've got a long story short, I bought a brand new North Face windbreaker and it was £100 and it's like, it was like the first expensive like clothing item that I bought myself in quite a while. That I treat myself, I'd see them quite a lot, really liked them, bought one, wore it for the second time. My brother accidentally spilled a bowl of chips on me when we were out for lunch, um, noticed a real grease stain on it, put some vanish on it, vanish works for everything, put it in wash, no else in the washer, no detergent, no scent boosters, no no, just put it in wash. <clears throat> it come out, the grease stain had gone, but then can you tell me why the entire coat was covered in stains? And after it had dried, there were stains all over it. So I have actually washed that North Face coat now 10 times. And finally, I washed it for the last time last night. And I put um, fairy liquid all over it. I soaked it in fairy liquid and then put it in the wash. And thankfully, it's all come out. So yeah, that's my little story about that. So if you've got a North Face windbreaker and a little grease stain or some mark that won't come out and wash with some vanish, fairy liquid, scrub it in, not too hard. Leave it to soak for about half an hour in fairy liquid. Put it in wash and it'll be fine. But now, on to the next thing, which can I just say how fucking cute is that? I'm all being funny with you. Look at that. It's a little fucking Stanley knife, look. A little Stanley knife, have you seen it? Eh? Stanley knife. Look, right. So basically, if you're like me and you watch TikTok, I always like um, search for like aesthetic uh, morning routines and um, restocks. I'm obsessed with watching restocks and they're all, they're all open in the boxes. This little like cloud Stanley knife from so I looked on Amazon and I couldn't find it. But one thing that I will say is a lot of the stuff that I've ordered on here I've actually seen on Amazon, but the American Amazon. So there's the UK Amazon obviously and then there's the US Amazon. And the US Amazon have like way better stuff than the UK when I wish to start like putting more of like the um, like the American Amazon products on the UK one. Um so I couldn't find this on the UK one, but then found it, right? on Timu and it was 89p and I love it and I've already been using it and that's blurred out but it's so cool look at that it's in the shape of a little a little cloud look look and that's sick uh, small minds but you know I think it's pretty sick uh, the next thing that I've got oh this is the last glass item that I have got and the thing is I do not remember this having a wood lid when I ordered it it must have done but I don't actually remember Oh god, see what I mean? I've just dropped the glass straw. So with it comes a glass straw, and then this is the glass. You'll have seen these. I saw these on Molly May's um, YouTube channel. Um, so it's these, but she got hers off Amazon, and it's the one with the wooden lids. But I don't actually like it with a wood lid. I just want it like that, with me drinking it, with me straw. You know, that's what I want, aesthetic. That's what I'm after here, aesthetic, yeah? I was never into straws before, I never used them. You know, if I ever got a drink with a straw and I used to take it out, but now the glass and the aesthetic, look, I am sweating my cock off. We can get rid of this bag. Yeah, because that's done. So that's the first half of the order done. Now we're on to the second. Now, this is where a lot of the electrical stuff is, and the electrical stuff is like so good. I'm way, way impressed with like the techie uh, electrical stuff. But I'm slightly a little bit concerned about this next thing that I'm about to show you. Now this is a I do not get on I do not understand this. It says please do not pedal on this box. Please do not pedal. What do you mean don't pedal it's a box? Anyway. So, as you all know, if you follow me for a long time or if you are new, I will let you know that I am someone who, who is always roasting hot. I'm sweating now as we speak. I am roasting warm. So I saw this um, section for air conditioning units and I thought, my God, because my dream one day is to build my own house. When I tell you I am having air conditioning, but I do not understand why houses in the UK don't have air conditioning. It makes no sense to me. I don't get it. So, when I build my own house, I'm going to build my own fucking air conditioning unit in it. But until then, I saw this. Now, at first glance, I thought, oh, it looks alright, to be fair. But on closer inspection, and I'm being brutal, I'm being honest, I'm not, I'm not going to lie to you, the quality is not fantastic. It's really not. I mean, I showed my brother this and he went, um, he went, have you seen all the wires underneath it? 
there's literal, I don't know if you can see, can you see like them red wires there, right? So you're supposed to put, right, ice cubes in here, yeah? In there, and then you're supposed to put the lid on, like that. The lid, to be fair, don't even fit properly, right? On like that, and then you're supposed to put like air conditioning on here, and it's an air conditioning little unit. But have you seen all them red wires there? If that leaks, right, which it won't surprise me if it did, if the, when the ice melts, right, and you put it in there, right, and it leaks, it's just going to leak under all them red wires there. So I think I'll probably use it, like, when I'm awake, because I sleep, so I thought, oh, God, I'll be able to sleep with it on a night. I'm not going to risk sleeping with this on, on a night. I will use it in my room, and I hope it does work, because it had good reviews. It says it's got a lamp on it. It's got a an atomization, a tight. It's got a timer, wind speed on off. I've not tried this yet. The other electric stuff I've tested out and it's all works amazingly. This I haven't tried yet. I don't actually know how you work it, but I know you're supposed to put ice at the top of it. Um, they did come well packaged in this big thing though. Look, look at that. But yeah. <clears throat> so honestly, guys, if you could see. The amount of shite that is here right now that you can't see on camera, it's building up and up and up and up. It's going to fucking topple over and come on me. So these I'm actually really, really excited for. And as you can tell, they're a copy of the Apple, whatever they're called, my AirPods, either the Apple, whatever, the big ones. And I tell you what, I've tried them and I tell you fucking what, the sound is fucking really good. These cost me $7.99. My little charger, a very fucking small charger. Look at this for a charging. Look at that. Small charging wire. But, honest to God, right, I'm not being funny with you. I've tried them. They're fucking fantastic for money. Look. Look at that. Look at that. I tell you what, really good um, noise. Uh, defenders on them and I swear to God with the um, I've connected them they're connected to my phone straight away and I'm not joking with you these are going to be great for editing and stuff these right I'm not being funny with you these are an absolute 10 out of 10 the sound is great they look good really 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 I'm just wipe all fucking sweat off them but really good really 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 spongy there sounds really good and that's what they look like look being funny with you funny with you but look at that eh? look $7.99 um so yeah so going on to the next thing here I got a wireless portable speaker this was $12.99 and I've tried this out and the sound and the bass is absolutely phenomenal probably one of the best wireless speakers I've ever had and probably one of the cheapest to be honest so it comes with all like the you know the wires and stuff to recharge it and I got it in this pattern because it reminded me like very sort of like Santorini Mykonosi sorry about that guys the uh, timer ran out but that's what I was saying I like the style of it and if you can see it it's like uh, blue triangles with grey and I think that's going to look real real nice I remember at my bedside table right anyway and it's by the brand T&G and the sound is so good the bass is so so good it's like got the rubber speakers on both sides so that's where the bass is and then all this is where like the the speaker bit is and that was all right and i so i thought that was really really good for the money and like i say i've tested it out and it sounds so good i'm not being funny with you that for like any any kind of anything is just going to be great it's going to be great in garden as well that for summer and stuff really really good because we're having to like bring the big um me mum and dad have got like a Bose, Amazon, big, it's a big fucking massive thing. And it were really fucking expensive. And um, yeah, I can't get this back on. This happened to me before, but we were having to use that and it was just quite weighty, you know, weighting it around. But a little portable thing like that, pretty fantastic if you ask me. Right, so I'm going to bring this on the bed now. Uh, because after this one thing here, this last electrical thing, the rest is skincare bits. So the next thing that I've got are these Pro 4 True Wireless Headsets. 
as you can see, they're a copy of the Amazon AirPods and I've tried them and they are absolutely fantastic. Do not spend £120 on a pair of wireless headphones because you don't need to. Get yourself on Timo, right, and get yourself a pair of these. It also comes with a wireless charger as well, as you can see. And if you can see there, it's flashing. If you can see it, but the green lights come on. Uh, which means they're fully charged and ready to go. So it has a little on off button there, if you can see it, I don't know if it's blowing it out. Um, and then you just flip it open like you do with just the AirPods. And then there they are. And that's them. Look. Boom. Done the, done the uh, test on them with the phone. They're connected. It's just told me now it's connected. And yeah. Really, really good. Right, the next thing that I want to show you, I actually think it's really, really cute. So have you seen like the little, small, little, oh god. Have you seen the small little um, Vaseline intensives? The little small tiny ones? They're about £5 on Amazon. Absolute rip off, right? Well, I've got a box of them in this box here. And look at this. You get eight little mini ones. These were £1.79 for eight little mini ones. Look at that. You get honey peach, sakura lips, strawberry, rose, original, avocado, lemon, and honey lips. Next thing that I've got are these Zahidu Sea Fennel. Jinkron electric eye masks. It's you know the eye masks that you put underneath the gel ones They sell these on Amazon as well. I've seen these before It's them ones look Them ones there, and then it's just when you They come with like all the little things like a little spoon And then they come in like this little thing and you look you take off the lid Like that and they're like that look, you know the ones that you put under your eyes. I think they were $1.99. The next thing that I've got is this little Vaseline cream bar, but I thought this was really, really like different because I've never seen it like this before. It's a it's a Vaseline stick. It's a stick look. And it comes like that. That's what it comes in. Like that. And then you literally just undo it like that and then you just you just turn it up like that and then you turn up and down. And you can put it on your face, your lips, wherever you've got a bit of dryness. So I just thought that was like really, really handy. And then I got these, which if you know uh, Lenage, um, you'll know that these are basically are a copy of that. As soon as I saw them, I thought, right, these are by Western Month, Sleeping Mask Berry. It's just a copy of the Lenage one. But the, la the Lenage one now is like £30, which I'm not paying £30 for a little lip mask. But yeah, that's what it comes in, and it comes with a little spoon as well. And I think they were £1.99 each, so I got two lip balms now i thought these were quite fun but i won't lie these smell quite chemically and it's this moisturizing stick and it's in the shape of like a lollipop and you're supposed to rub it on your lips uh this is grape lip balm it doesn't smell the grape it smells of chemicals is what it smells like um i don't know honestly if i want to really be be using these but this is what they look like i'm gonna try and do it on my top there so you can sort of see it so it don't get blurred out but that's what they look like look they're like that they're on like a little stick and you're supposed to just sort of like all like that it just smells like chemicals it does not smell of great but I'll tell you what it's moisturizing also I've actually got one more thing and it's a it's a lip oil it's a little lip oil I put this on on a night time because it is good I've actually had this before off Amazon and you just you just literally just put it on in little stick things and you just like rub it on your lips um and this actually is really 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 good it's actually very very good um and that was really cheap because this on amazon's about eight quid but i think i paid about one pound something for it so definitely cheaper on timu and then i got these little things right because i just thought that these right were actually proper sick like timu do like a lot of mini as you can see like mini lip balms and like I've got these little mini hand creams because I've always got like the driest hands, yeah, proper dry hands, dry skin all the time. Um, I'm forever going on about it, I forever go through hand creams. But then I saw these, look, and they're just like really small little diddy hand creams. I don't know, I just thought they were fun. Look, by a brand called Akinen Hand Cream. So I got two in, what is this, what scent is this? I don't know. I know this is something like it's all in Korean, so I'll be able to tell you. One's like a mango and summer, and the other one's like like lime and summer and summer. So 
when I actually tried one of these, one of the green ones, I want it, it were bust open a bit, so I had to clean it up a bit. But I haven't tried this one yet. And this one. So I'll see what this smells like. Oh, now you see here, look. See, this one's sealed, right? One of the other ones that I opened, you know, that were all over, weren't sealed. Mmm. So, I'm going to take this off, and then I'm going to... Oh, that's nice. Oh, I wish I'd have got more. I wish I'd have got more in this. This is like orangey, mango orangey. Oh. Oh, that's already nicer. Oh, that's already way nicer. Do you know what that smells like? That smells like my little uh, baby nephew, uh, Billy. Like, you know what the wash is closing and stuff. That's what that smells like. That's nice, that. Eh? It's really good. And like I said, I paid for it all myself. Um, and I'm actually really happy with the money that I spent on what I got. Um, so if you did like this video, guys, please do make sure to give it a big thumbs up. It really, really helps me and my channel out. And even if you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. I need all the interaction that I can get. That's exactly what I need. Uh, leave me some nice comments in the comments bar below as well. Um, I love speaking to you guys uh, in the comments and also as well on my Instagram. I will leave my Instagram and my Vinted and my TikTok down below. Go and follow me on my TikTok and my Instagram and my go follow my Vinted. Because like I say, um, I've got rid of much pretty the... I've pretty much got rid of all my wardrobe and a lot of it's already sold. Um, I love my TikTok. I just like a twat on there. It's a real good time. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.